uh, without alcohol or any drugs. Just broadcasting. Uh, we stay up and make music. No, I'm back. And I know there's a lot of other people that make music out here and they want to do it too. So we're going to let you sit in. Um, How's that? You're going How to many people are going to sit in anyway? No, no, no. One, two. Linda Bryant, you got some? Did you bring anything? I, <laughs> okay, well, yeah, we'll figure something out. We have a little miracle that happened tonight. And who was it? Elvis was saying, Dan, you never know, miracles can happen, you know. You just meet new things. And the wisdom coming from the Oki from Muskogee, Elvis. But then we have Sheila here who's going to share an amazing moment with somebody else. And it's going to be a miracle. Hey, watch out, Bert. <laughs> All right. And then here's another miracle. I always wanted to play with Hank Hirsch again after playing with him at, at Ivory's, but I've been, I'm kind of uh, been blacklisted from there because I'm not your typical jazz player. So what happened is my sax player couldn't make it, and I got, got him after all. So that's how we ended up with Hank. Yay. See? You got blacklisted too? God, I, I just played there once and they kicked me out. Maybe it was all those yeah, drinks I had. Not I don't black know. You're just not trying hard now. And then again, the drummer, he was sick and just got back from China, hasn't seen his wife and kids in a month. And I said, well, take the time off. And, and so we, we got Jay Harris. Yeah. So yeah, and then, and we wouldn't even be doing it this if it wasn't for David J. White. Yeah. Thank you very much. Or is it Bernie? Do we owe it all to Bernie? Oh, Bernie. Yeah, we owe it all to Bernie. Bernie, our Bernie. Bernie Lewis, right there. Bernie, Bernie. You're sitting again. Do it. The days grow long And soon I'll hear Oh, winter song But I miss you most of When autumn leaves 
star to fall. To fall. dimensions where time and coincidence happen and you have a coincidence so tell me about it well the incident is this I moved to, Ca to uh, Portland a few years ago mm -hmm. and somebody told me about uh, TVI Transformational Voice Institute and invited me down to one of their open evenings. And I went down and got up cold and sang the song I'm gonna sing tonight. And it was really great, and I really loved what she was doing. So I decided to sign up for a couple of classes with her. 
And actually, my breathing's good, except once in a while. I've, my, I've increased my range, my vocal range, and I can, I can t and got through that break, you know, that little place in your voice where you kind of crack from the lower register up to your head. And it's been wonderful. It's made such a difference in my singing, so thanks to Linda. So this song is gonna be dedicated to Linda because it's the first song she ever heard me singing and it's the first song I ever sang at her place. So this is for you, Linda. Thank you. <laughs> Joe, I got a little story you ought to know. We're drinking, my friend, to the end of a brief episode. Just make it one for my baby. The routine, drop another nickel in that machine. I'm feeling so bad. I wish you'd make the music dream. Just make it one for my baby, one for the road. You'd never know it, but buddy, I'm a kind of poet, and I've got a lot of things to say. You gotta listen to me until it's talked away. Well, that's how it goes. Joe, I know you're getting anxious to close. So thanks for the cheer. I hope you didn't mind my
this routine So drop another nickel in that machine